port of San Juan. And off in the distance over here we have the uh, Fort Mother Point. This is right out here. Alright, welcome to San Juan, Puerto Rico. Bienvenidos. We made it. We're doing a walking tour of the old town. We can go check out the fort and some of the old sites to see. We've downloaded an informational walk tour from the website. We can check it out. We, we did that when we were down in Tombstone. And it was really informative and pretty awesome because it tracks your GPS movements and, and it starts talking to you when you get to a point of interest. So. That's what we're doing today. It's gonna to be pretty fun. Check out these old brick streets. <laughs> Those are pretty neat. I'm not sure what this building is, but that's pretty cool looking. All right, so it looks like that's the Casino de Puerto Rico. Beautiful building. All right, there's our first sights of the fort. Flying three flags, pretty awesome. All right, we're walking down the old town, San Juan, down this brick street. It's pretty neat. I'll flip it around, flip it around here. Pretty awesome. This building's like 500 years old. Look at the dates on this. All right, we got the local wildlife so far. Hey, we found some more local wildlife, different species this time. That's dinner. Might be dinner. Better be careful, buddy. And we even got some more local wildlife. The dead cockroach. What was that point of interest, George? Very important. There's a fork in the road. Wow. So which way we need to go? I don't know. I'm just saying there's a fork in the road. But it's pointing that way. It is pointing that way. Let's do. Let's try. Let's see where the fork goes. <laughs> All right, there's a point of interest here. The infamous yellow house. It's the narrowest in town. I would venture to guess they have to sleep in the uh, hallway. All right, so this sign tells us a little bit about the fort. The fort's here. We're standing here at this guardrail. And you can see down here, you know, they're over here working on the wall. It's part of the National Park Service, but it goes on down through there. We're going to work our way through town and up. Check out those fuzzy flowers. Those are pretty cool. Never seen anything like that before. Right, here's one of the lookout posts on the so no guard in the guard tower but we got ourselves a guarding iguana there's a neat little section of the wall with all the statues and All right, so that's the selfie picture back in the day. And this is the Lion King. We got a baby pose right there. That's a super cool tree. Check that out. It's like a tree and a vine all combined.
right, we made it down to the coast, the bottom side of the fort. I'll be able to spin around here and you can see the whole wall and everything right here. And we're going to follow it all the way to the end where the fort is. All on the fort wall now. Yeah. All right, getting ready to go into the chapel or the church. Wow, that's pretty. Beautiful. That's a pretty cool pillar. into the military barracks back in the day. Pretty area. Cover six city blocks. Pretty neat. Alright, we made it through the old city tour. And we finally made it to the first of two forts that we're going to visit. And it's right out over this grassy knoll there. That's the one we saw coming in on the cruise ship this morning. I'm going to go check it out up close. There is a beautiful fort. You can see the whole wall down there around the sea line. All right. That's almost like a moat, kind of. I don't know if they put water up here or not, but there's some. There's a bridge into the fort. There's the main fort. It's like a waterway or something underneath, a stairway down to it. So this is a dry mark, not a wet mark. Pretty neat. Mm -hmm. Alright, we made it to the entrance. Just noticing we got an iguana in the hole there and another one over here. Pretty cool. What was that, Kim? That right there is a Puerto Rican lawnmower. Oh, yeah. What would that be? One of those guys? Yeah. Ah, oh, check him out. I need to get a couple of those for my yard. <laughs> All right, we made it inside the fort walls. goes down to the the cannon stations that's awesome that's the storeroom gunpowder magazine magazine is where they store ammunition that's pretty neat you can't go in there but looks like there's stairs down to an area where you can see out to the sea and this takes us up to the top level all right, we got our first look at the high point. 
strategic in battle. All right. This is where the cannon would sit. It has the directional angle here so you can get a wide angle and be narrow at the front for protection. All right, so here's the over the wall. And that's what you'd see back in the day if you're standing on this platform looking out over the area. Looks like that's the lower level down there. We're going to end up down there in a minute. All right, here's a walkway that goes out to the lookout point. Hey. Hey. See you guys. These are all the gunner stations with the cannons in each. No cannons today, but that's that lookout we just went out to look at. And right here, if you're trying to come in across that bridge, uh, I think you'd run into problems right here with the cannon portal right there. like this one is actually intact it looks like probably some kind of a jail or put you down in there and lock you up it's a pretty cool fort there's the big old watchtower and then the flags we're on the upper deck of the floor. It's pretty neat. So it looks like that's not really a watchtower. It looks like it's a lighthouse. Looks like they got a lighthouse uh, thing up there. It's pretty neat. All right, so this is the cannon pivots. Spin around on these uh, tracks so they can get an angle of all directions from right here. Found another pivot. I'll leave my bag here because it's narrow. Oh wow, that breeze through here is amazing. Look at that view. <laughs> That's the best view in the house right there. That's awesome. Alright, we're going to go 
in the secret passageway to the lower level. All right, we got some more local wildlife here. It looks like some kind of a sea crab. Oh, he just went into his hole. Cool. We got some really cool arch tunnels down here. Looks like there were rooms for something. Looks like they got some kilns there. Maybe they did some cooking. This is the kitchen. I've seen them. There's another little area with bars. Oh, a couple of rooms. This might be where they hung out and watched for uh, boats to come in and stuff. A long stairway we just went up right there. massive stairway we just went up. I don't know how many stairs, but it was a lot. Super cool. That's how we keep our hiking legs in, in shape. All right, we just finished this fort number one right here. Now we're gonna head off down into this little building here. Follow the shoreline down and off into the distance right there is the other fort go check it out now too so super excited to see another fort because this one was super cool uh, one of the coolest forts i've ever seen all right we found it to the cemetery it's a pretty cool cemetery Did. All right, we're getting the fresh coconuts here. There's the master at work. We just chopped the top off and cut it out. Right on. Woohoo! All right, we got our coconuts. Chris has been wanting one from the coconut stand. We got one. That's really good. Let's go, let's go! All right, we're getting close. We've made it to the other fort. Can't remember the name. I think it's Castillo, Fort Castillo, I think. All right, we made it to the next fort. Woo -hoo. How cool is that? This is really awesome. Huh. Pretty awesome. Big cannons. That's a little guy compared to that one right there. Look at that. That's a big old cannon. All right, made it into the barracks where they slept. Got their guns there and their muskets. And a little look, stairs to a lookout there, it looks like. I'd like to have that view for a bathtub. Yeah. All right, here's our circular t staircase to the observatory. These little stair towers are super cool. Yeah. All right, 
right, we made it up to the top deck where the flags are flying. View of the sea. All right, just to put it into perspective, made it up on top, overlooking the bay here. And there's the cruise terminal right there. That's our boat this trip. And when we went last February, that was our boat. <laughs> so much bigger. Look at them. Holy cow. Station. This is where all the cannons and supplies and cannonballs and cannons. And looks like we got some cannonballs there. All right. Well, obviously these cannonballs go to a bigger cannon than the ones that uh, it's on display there. But that's pretty impressive. You fill those with gunpowder and stick them in a cannon, blast them away. Yeah, there's even a lower area there we can go check out. Impressive. All right, so apparently there's this secret tunnel that we gotta check out. Let's see where it goes. The upper tunnel to the dungeon. Oh, this is gonna, this is gonna be cool. All right, Christy's excited to go in the dungeon. That's what the sign says, we're out there. Dungeon, here we come. All right, let's see where we're going. Okay, looks like a supply room. We got some cannonballs in there. Wow, this tunnel goes forever. Must be the jail or the brigade. That tunnel went for a long ways, and now I just had to stop the video for a minute. But now we're back. Oh wow! So now we're to the secret garden. to the dark <laughs> you trip over yourself anyway that was a fun little dungeon tunnel to go down I'm gonna check out this little jail area this uh, I'm assuming it's jail there's bars on the door all right here we go oh it smells like a cave in here Ooh, stinky Smells like a bat cave. This is in the galleons. Let's see. So there's some original uh, markings on the wall from the people that were down here in the dungeons. Oh, that's a ship. That's pretty good that's artwork. A ship. I know. One, two, three, four ships. That is neat. That is cool. I'll give me one little light to look outside. All right, well that concludes our tour of the two forts and along the shoreline with the battery walls. And pretty awesome to see how it was back then. If it's still here and existent today, like 500 years old or so. I don't know about this one. Yeah, but anyway, it's super impressive. So we're gonna head back to the boat and see what else we can see along the way. All right, we're leaving Puerto Rico. San Juan. Looks like we're back. We're backing up and getting ready to 
turned around and head on out of here. There's the airport. That's pretty cool that it's right there on the beach. Speaking of, got one coming in for landing. Had a good day. We had a walking tour. Went and did a couple of forts. Saw yeah. the old town and yeah. the old brick streets. It's really cool. Uh, one thing that I have to say about Puerto Rico, it's a lot hot and humid more than Utah. Holy cow. It's really humid. <laughs> we were dying. It was Sweaty. so hot. Oh my gosh. Sweaty and muggy and all. I'm not a huge goodness. sweater, but I'm dripping sweat. Anyway, we had a great time. Beautiful. Yep. Bye, San Juan, and where are we headed now? Uh, Grand Turk. Grand Turk. Here we come. We're gonna ride some trikes. We're gonna ride some trikes. <laughs> We're going back to our childhood. Yeah. <laughs> Should be fun.